Hi guys, so today I have a package to unbox with you guys. This is something that I pre-ordered, I don't remember if I pre-ordered it in January or December, but it actually got lost, so I had to get a replacement sent to me. So it took about two months to actually arrive. It did come from the UK and it is pretty damaged, but hopefully everything is okay on the inside and it'll end up being a really interesting unboxing for some of you. And I feel like this is a band that isn't too well known or talked about as much anymore. Um, so maybe you guys will actually give them a listen and maybe enjoy them. But this is the package right here. As we can see, there's a bunch of dents in here. You guys can see there's a crease here, a dent here. It is actually bent, like right here. There's a big puncture right here. I'm gonna go ahead, slice it open, and we're just gonna jump into it. And as you guys can see here, it says that it's the replacement that the other one was missing in the post. This is Yumi at Six's newest album called Suck a Punch. So I got the cassette and vinyl bundle. Again, this was coming from the UK, so it was a little bit pricey and definitely a little bit more money than what I tend to spend on stuff like this, but I do really enjoy Yumi at Six. I did get their last album and it was an exclusive pressing as well and I was excited that it was autographed because I'm always trying to collect autographs and stuff. Um, some of the signatures are a little more faded and not as visible as others but it is definitely signed by all five members which is super cool. I really like the cover art that they did for this as well but I think they did a really good job with this. So. And it is in like this kind of plastic sleeve. Obviously they had to open it and that way they could sign it. But um, this is the track list right here. I haven't actually been able to listen to any of this yet. Super excited to give this a try. I did enjoy their last project quite a bit. I do enjoy most of their stuff. This did come with the cassette. They had other bundles that also came with the CD or t-shirts and stuff, but they got more expensive and then with having to pay the shipping and everything. So I did just get the one with the cassette because I've been trying to grow my cassette collection a little bit and I do film a few videos on my cassette collection here and there. For collector's purposes I am going to keep this sealed. Um, I don't really open most of my modern cassettes, I just like to own them. I loved the color of this one. It's kind of like this highlighter yellow, almost green. We're going to take a look at the pressing. I believe I got the splatter pressing. I think there was a few different pressings available. Um, if not, there were definitely at least um, this one and then the standard one, I believe. So we're going to actually take it out of this little plastic that they put on it. Really nice kind of matte. I don't know how to explain it, like a cardboard sort of feel to it. I mean, I know it's paper, but very nice. Obviously, the signatures are going to stick to that super well since it's not glossy or anything. So I really like that. And then if we look inside here... It looks like we have a little booklet. Let me set that aside for right now. And let me just take this out and set it down. Oh, we have two different things going on here. So first off, we have a lyric sheet, it looks like. So you have all the songs um, per whichever side they're on with all the lyrics. Very, very nice. I really like that. And then we also get a booklet or maybe this is actually a poster but it says suck a punch matte black got this picture it kind of reminds me of the easier promo promo photos and teeth promo photos that five sauce did and then you open it and you've got a really 
really nice collage. Like this coloring effect just makes me think about Contagion. <laughs> I don't know why. Um, so that's interesting, but really nice uh, collage of photos here. Kind of like a little fold out booklet sort of moment. I think that's nice that they added that little touch there instead of just including the lyric sheet, but I also really appreciate the lyric sheet as well. I like it when vinyl comes with anything extra like this. And let's get into the pressing. This is a really pretty pressing, very similar to the weekend's um, anniversary pressing that he put out for... Oh my god, what was that album? Beauty Behind the Madness. I was drawing a blank. Um, I think this is very similar to that, so I'm super excited to see. Very nice um, black paper sleeve, and then you have the anti-static wax uh, insert uh, middle, whatever you want to call this. Really, really nice high quality sleeve. I think they did a great job with that. And look at that. This is a beautiful pressing. They did a phenomenal job with this. I think this looks fantastic. I love this pressing. I think it obviously complements the album cover super well, the aesthetic that they're going for. I think it's beautiful. I'm really happy that I was able to support them directly and buy it off of their merch shop. They sing some of my favorite songs, um, definitely some older ones for sure. They did some really nice collabs back in the day that I think was like kind of like at their peak, I guess you could say, or when they were most popular and well known. And they'd be in alternative press all the time and rock sound. Oh, and I think we got a digital download. Oh my gosh, I haven't got one of these in forever. So if anybody wants to give them a try and you actually want to download the album, I'm going to give you guys the digital download. You got to do it on a PC, but you're going to go to this uh, website that they have here and enter in this code if you want to go ahead and screenshot and uh, enter this, you're more than welcome to it. So whoever wants to claim this first, here you go. I uh, hope that you guys enjoy the album. I hope that you guys give it a listen. Um, let me know how it goes. Let me know what your favorite tracks are down below, but definitely give it a try for sure. Uh, listen to some of their older stuff as well. I will go ahead and link it down below. This is not sponsored in any way, but I just like to give a little extra love to some of the more underrated bands that I do enjoy on my channel and try to promote them when I can. So thank you guys for watching. I hope that you guys have an amazing day and I will see you again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.